Hello everyone. Uh, today I am going to uh, explain the minimum level learning syllabus for math standard. And uh, this video I am uh, preparing for those students, uh, jo, uh, those who are uh, afraid or uh, taking the pressure uh, for writing the board exam, math standard. So let us start with the uh, first uh, slide minimum level daily revision syllabus. So whatever the syllabus I am going to discuss, if they focus on that much syllabus, they can easily score good marks, not only passing marks, they can score good marks. So first they should complete the first chapter, they, they should start with the first chapter that is real numbers, uh, which is of 6 marks weightage, okay. Or is mein kya kya karna hai, first uh, NCRT textbook uh, examples and uh, exercise as for revised syllabus. Revised syllabus means the first exercise has been uh, deleted. So I will show the textbook also. So in this uh, chapter, this part has been deleted. So this may you pura exercise drop kar sakte hai, except this third question because third question can be solved by using prime factorization method also and even one example, this example, example number four. Okay, so uh, because of uh, less uh, syllabus in this chapter, this is very scoring and if you practice very well, uh, you can score full six marks from this chapter. And all the NCRT textbook examples and exercise you have to complete. And the second part, uh, I will be going to upload uh, today that minimum level learning study material Okay, you can download it from this website. I will give the link uh, uh, in my description also. And also you have to complete CBSC previous 10 years questions. If you complete this much part, you can easily score 6 marks. And before that, uh, uh, you should know uh, the split up of 100 marks. 100 marks may 80 marks show here. The 80 marks is for theory and 20 marks is for the practical uh, activities or internal marks we can say and together is 100. So if uh, the student uh, follow the instructions of teachers whatever the project assigned activities so they can easily score including pe periodic test marks they can easily score around 50 marks from out of 20 minimum minimum I am talking about minimum and uh, uh, 80 may up student ko chahiye 18 marks only 18 marks because together together 33 marks is the passing criteria for uh, class 10th uh, maths uh, for all subjects so 18 marks is not a big task for uh, scoring in board exam if you follow my instruction okay so this is the first chapter and uh, out of 18 now you can easily score 6 marks from here now let us move towards the next uh, unit this is algebra unit. Algebra unit may uh, only I am going to take three uh, chapters. First polynomial. Polynomial is also is uh, now it become easy because the difficult part of the chapter has been removed that is division part. And similarly the quadratic equation also uh, is very easy has become easy because the difficult part of the chapter that is uh, situational uh, prob uh, problems based questions, word problems that has been removed for this academic year and uh, arithmetic progression may be jo, uh, some of n terms ke jo word problems hai, wo bhi is saal ke liye remove ho gaya and uh, I am not going to consider here the linear equation in two variables because in that chapter many word problems are there uh, even some uh, questions are there which uh, which is based on reducible to linear equation uh, so usme thode bachcho ko dikkat hota hai so ab usko mai exclude kar raha hu yahan par so you can uh, score around 15 marks not exactly because one more chapter is there in this unit so i'm taking at 15 or it can be 16 also so isme aapko kya kya karna hai first ncert textbook ke sare examples with respect to the uh, revised syllabus and exercise okay exercise questions and next uh, again you have to do all the questions whatever the questions uh, I'm going to uh, publish in minimum level study material um, 
which is available in this website, my website blog. And the third one is you have to do all the CBSE previous 10 years questions excluding the deleted part. Okay, so uh, now 15 plus 6 21 marks. Yahan tak 21 marks ho gaya hai. Now let us move toward the next uh, uh, chapter in which you have to do that is triangles theorems only in which you can easily score 4 out of 4 marks. And this is the theorem hai is ke liye. only two theorems are there basic proportionality theorem and Pythagoras theorem. If you practice very well, you can easily score 4 marks, 4 out of 4 marks. So total marks 25. Now coordinate geometry. Ye bhi ab chapter chota ho gaya because one part of this chapter has been uh, topic uh, has been removed that is area of triangle. Only two topics are there distance formula and uh, uh, section formula. Wo bhi, uh, Textbook say uh, sare examples or exercise questions complete karne. Next thing, whatever the questions I am publishing in my minimum level study material that uh, you have to complete, okay, which is available in uh, this blog and CBSE previous 10 years questions. So if you complete all this three part from this chapter, you can easily score six marks. Kyunki chapter baat chota ho gaya. Okay, and uh, now we are moving towards the next chapter, circle. Circle is also a very small chapter, and uh, circle, jo hai, wo three to four marks ka aata exam hai. So main minimum marks three marks mein assume kar raha hu par. And uh, you have to complete all the NCRT examples and exercise questions, and uh, some questions I have uh, given in my minimum study, level study material and CBSE previous ten years questions. If you if you complete all these uh, um, section, you can easily score 3 to 4 marks because now CBSE has not published the sample paper. Uh, uh, that is why we are not sure that how much mark they are going to put. Last year 3 marks. Tha. So this year it may be 4 uh, marks because basic ka last year 6 marks. Tha. So I am taking minimum 3 marks. Okay. Now next is construction. Construction is very scoring chapter. Only uh, two sections are there. Ek to construction of uh, division of line segment in some uh, given ratio, and the second one is tangent construction of tangent. If you practice these two constructions very well, you can easily score four marks. So, is my cable example NCRT ke examples or exercise questions si karne. Next statistics, statistics and probability together eleven marks are there. So sometimes uh, statistics ka zyada uh, questions aate hain kabi probability ke questions aate hain so together i am going to take 11 marks so abhi last year ke sample paper ke basis pe ye 8 marks ka tha so ncrt textbook all examples and exercise questions ab is topic mein uh, do section removed ho gaya ek to uh, last og wala jo questions hain that exercise has been removed and the next one is the step division method but still student can use step division method if they wish okay so now this chapter is also become uh, shorter so you can uh, complete this chapter with full confidence and uh, you have to uh, complete some questions given in uh, my study material and CBSE previous 10 years question. Agar itna karenge to you can easily score full marks uh, from statistics. Okay and the next one is 3 marks. I just now told you that the, together these two chapters is 11 marks. So, uh, dono ko chapter, dono chapter ke 11 marks man ke chaliye. and probability mein all examples, exercise questions uh, you have to complete along with minimum study material and all uh, CBSE previous 10 years questions. If you complete all these questions, you can easily score uh, 11 marks along with statistics. So, this is the structure of uh, syllabus, uh, 6 marks first chapter and this unit 15 marks triangles theorem 4 marks, coordinate geometry 6 marks, circles 3 marks, it may be 3 to 4 also, construction 4 marks, statistics 6 marks and this is 3 marks, this is together 11 marks. So around 49 marks you can easily score out of 80 marks if you concentrate on this much syllabus only plus 20 marks internal. Agar internal may be up to 15 marks meant that 49 plus 15. 64 marks you can score easily. Now 
after completing all these uh, chapters uh, i would like to tell you that you can complete some important questions from the remaining chapters so remaining chapters just a linear equation in two variable this may graph related questions today easy hai. Uh, student can do very easily and uh, the questions based on comparing the ratio of coefficients okay uh, these two questions can be completed and the second triangles may one mark questions complete kar sakte hai, uh, important questions and the trigonometry unit all ncrt important questions and area related circles may be kuch important questions complete kar sakte hai. and surface areas and volumes all important uh, ncrt important questions this all questions uh, i will publish in my minimum level study material if you complete uh, that uh, much uh, portion i 100% uh, assure that you can score easily more than 60 marks out of 80 so 60 plus 20 80 marks so it is very easy to score uh, in passing mark even good marks in maths uh, standard exam so jo bacche dar rahe pressure mein i would like to tell you that uh, tell to those students that uh, there is no uh, no need to take so much uh, pressure please follow these my instructions you will get uh, good marks in a math standard exam okay and i wish you all the best for your bright future so that's all for today's session thank you thank you very much